inna lil muttaqina mafaza no doubt about it believers have the ultimate success mafaz is a time of success a place of success the place of success is jannah the time of success is the day of resurrection both of them crammed into one statement inna lil muttaqina mafaza they're both in together See the word mafaz because it's a dharf, it captures both the place and the time. Previously for the criminals, Allah mentioned judgment day separately, Allah mentioned hell separately. For the believers, He combined them into one. And that's also to describe how smooth the transition will be from judgment day into jannah for the believers. May Allah make us from them. Inna lil muttaqina mafaza for those who protected themselves, those who took caution there is going to be ultimate success. Allah could have said, for those who believe, but no, He said, those who protect themselves. At the end of the day, the struggle to get to the, the heaven that Allah made for humanity, is the struggle of somebody deciding that they're going to protect themselves. Protect themselves from who? First of all, protect themselves from the evil that lies inside of them. You know? The, the shuh al-anfus, the greed inside of them, the lust inside of them. Look, inside, we are made of a body and a soul, and your body is an animal. Your body has an appetite. It wants to eat. It wants to fulfill its lusts. Your eyes want to look at things that are attractive. You, your body calls for things. And your soul is telling you, stop, protect yourself. You're not like an animal. Stop. You can't just eat whatever you want. You can't just do whatever you want. You have to hold yourself back. And if you keep giving into your body, your soul starts suffocating. You no longer have the ability to protect yourself. It's like a, those of you that work out understand. When you don't work out a muscle, it gets weaker. When you go back after a month of taking a break, you can't bench the same weight anymore, man. You gotta keep going back and strengthening that muscle. There's an ability inside you to stop you from evil. When you stop exercising that muscle, it gets weaker and weaker and weaker, and you're no longer able to protect yourself. Then you're just an animal. In the Qur'an's language, you're dead. Because your, your heart is dead. You know, لِيُنْذِرَ مَنْ كَانَ حَيًّا This Qur'an only warns those that are still alive. If you're not alive anymore, these words don't mean anything. 